this is one of the coolest new features of Cinema 4D version 15. It's the new uh, text editing options. So I'm just going to start by creating a mo text object. And I'm going to middle align this like that. And I'm going to type in a quick VFX. And I'm just going to click away so it updates. And I'm going to change the font to a Soho Gothic maybe, something like that. And just adjust the thickness, give it some fillet caps, uh, reduce the radius, like that. Okay, so a new feature in a Cinema 4D version 15 is this. If you go into a object, we've got this show 3D GUI setting, which is really cool. So if you check that, each letter has its own control handle now. So let's say I want to adjust the uh, kerning of I. I can simply click on I and then um, I can just move this along, just drag it from here. And I can also uh, increase the Y scale and the X scale. And I can even change the base position. So let's say uh, you've got a floor object and you want each kind of letter to touch the floor perfectly. You can basically adjust each letter. So the C would be uh, dipping below the floor usually, like that. So I can just simply pull this up slightly so it's kind of in line with all the other letters. And um, also, alternatively, you can click this little arrow and adjust. It's basically the exact same settings, but in a kind of interface here. So if I just click the K, I can adjust the kerning manually from here, uh, tracking. Uh, the scale, vertical scale, uh, kind of general scale, overall scale, and baseline shift. So this is a very powerful addition to the tool set of uh, Cinema 4D and I personally find it really useful and uh, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Thanks for watching.